Welcome back to the channel guys, it's another video about Spark Point, okay, and as you can see, um, we have got a breakout, alright, if you saw my community post yesterday, I did kind of try and signpost you guys to that and let you know that it was happening, alright, but as you can see, uh, Spark Point has got a breakout, um, if we draw a line like that, okay, we can see that it's broken out of a triangle, alright, and it's currently up about 50% or was up about 50%. We'll have to remeasure that and see whether it's where it's dropped to at the moment. Okay, but we had that drawn out like that. Okay, and we obviously got the breakout. We also said that um, in, in yesterday's video, I also said that it looked like there was an Adam and Eve reversal pattern forming. Okay, so you got an Adam and an Eve. Okay, and then you see it normally breaks out to the upside. So that's another reason why we're bullish on Spark Point to get that breakout. All right, guys. Um, if we look on a larger scale, you could see one forming as well, like Adam, and then if that can curve around and get an Eve, a big giant one. All right, and that will bring it, you know, a massive move to the upside. But Another thing I want to look at is the fact that it is kind of mirroring the price action from the previous pump as well, okay? Um, we've always said that history doesn't repeat itself where it rhymes, but if we go backwards, we can look and see uh, what was happening over here in relation to what I was expecting over here. All right, guys, so if we enlarge on that, okay? Enlarge on that and bring that out. So you can see the last time we had a pump, you could see we see it came up, down, bounced, okay, came back down and it leveled out for a bit. All right, guys, and then we had that similar pump to what we're seeing now, okay. It was a bit larger last time, obviously, because the price is lower, all right. So you can see that that was about a 200% move, all right. And then what it did is it found support above this level and started moving alongside there, okay. So if we draw a line there for you. Okay, so it was going sideways. We got the pump, all right, the breakout of the downward sloping resistance. Let's draw that in. Okay, breakout of there, all right, guys. And then what it did is it found support at a higher level and it carried on sideways for a bit, okay. And then we got that pump to the upside. It did kind of try and drop through, but then it, it recovered, all right, and then you saw a breakout to the upside. And that's where we had the last massive pump, all right, guys. So I kind of see the similarities in that happening here. All right, so let's show you. So just like we said, we saw the pump, it come down, we got a bounce and it come down and started going sideways and now we're starting to see that breakout, okay? You can see, we've got the breakout of the downward sloping resistance. All right, uh, also what we have now, if we draw a horizontal in there, we have it just sitting above that resistance, okay? And now we could potentially see it begin to make, find some support and carry on going sideways here if it doesn't just take off to the upside, all right, guys? Um, so that would be nice to see, just nice to see that, just carry on going sideways now, all right? Go sideways for a bit and then we can get a massive wave free to the upside, all right? And that's what I'm seeing in Spark Point, all right? The similarities are there. Hopefully, you can see what I'm talking about, you know? Um, yeah. It would be nice to see that pattern play out all over again, all right? And that will take us into tremendous gains, all right, guys? So, if it does continue sideways like that, uh, if I do see another breakout coming, all right, come sideways, sideways. I see a breakout coming after that happens, all right. That's if that does play out, because I could be wrong, okay, at the end of the day, you know. But, you know, I will be potentially looking to, you know, increase my position after a breakout of that, and we can ride that to the upside, just like I did over there, okay, just like I did over here. Oh, when I saw this breakout coming, right, I just quickly bought a big bag of spark point, right. Rid that all the way up to the upside, sold the top, 
fought back in down the bottom. All right, guys. Now, I don't get every trade perfectly like that, all right, because I don't have eyes everywhere. All right, but I managed to catch it at a good time and I managed to sell it at a great time. And, you know, that was a good trade for me. All right, guys. So the long term potential is definitely there for Spark Point. Even when I did sell the top over there, I did leave a good couple of million Spark Point on the table. All right, guys. Um, no, I left one million Spark Point on the table. All right, guys, because I think that that could go a long way anyway. All right, but when it came back down, I did buy my whole bag of Spark Point back at the time. All right, and um, now um, I'll be looking to potentially, you know, double down on my position potentially. All right, guys and ride that up as you can see it's up 45 percent over the past 24 hours it was up a little bit higher than that obviously you can see from the breakout um from the breakout or from let's just go from where i um kind of posted the signal yesterday you can see it actually went up about 42 percent from there but if you're looking from the bottom or right from the very bottom you can see it's up about a hundred percent okay in the previous previous video what i was saying is that i wanted to see it hold this support okay and we were up here at the time but once we broke out of this level and we broke down through that level and lost that support level okay if you go back you'll see that i did say that i expected it to come down and potentially bounce off this level but what i didn't want it to see was it fall through that level because if it did that probably would have put me a little bit bearish for a little bit of a longer period all right but as you can see we got the bounce it came up it tested that resistance line came down and then broke straight through it like butter all right guys and now hopefully we can create at least a new support along this line and ride that to the upside all right guys so that's what i'm seeing is spark point okay now they've also launched um on uniswap and they've got the liquidity pool there all right guys so that would have contributed to this all right and sometimes it's all about timing right you can see the chart set up and you know the time the, the timing was just perfect for that all right and you know it's all playing out really well okay uniswap is obviously one of the biggest exchanges and is growing fast you know everyone's hyped about uniswap you know i'm not a great fan of uniswap personally you know I, I like to be able to get in and out of my position like this or put an order in buy order sell order you can you can do a market buy and get straight out yeah or do a market buy and get straight in with exchanges like uniswap or swap exchanges there's high gas fees with the ethereum um there's a lot of slippage and so on all right guys so i do prefer to use my exchanges but each of them are okay we've all got our own uh, preferences all right guys but yeah spark point has definitely got a long-term potential for me and um yeah it's good to see the chart uh, moving the way i expected all right guys and I could have got it wrong, but it doesn't look like I have. All right, guys, and yeah, I'm just definitely looking forward to see what else uh, Sparkpoint's got to offer for us. Do apologize for the background noise, okay? I'm working from home. Got the family at home. My wife is working from home. My son is out of nursery at the moment. So yeah, sometimes you're gonna hear a bit of noise in the background, all right, guys? But uh, yeah, I guess we can still get on and do what we need to do. As long as you can hear me clearly, that's all that matters, all right, guys? So yeah. That's it for now. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please do me a favor and subscribe. Leave a like and a comment down below. Let me know what you think about Spark Point. Did you manage to get in? Look out for the community post, guys, because, you know, every now and again, it is quicker to kind of take a screenshot and get that out. And you lot will be able to see what I'm talking about. All right, guys, because when it comes to making a video, it can take me, you know, best part of an hour to get that uploaded. All right, sometimes, you know, I can do quicker. All right, but sometimes I need to go in and uh, kind of do a bit of editing. All right, but yeah, um, keep an eye out for the community posts. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video.